I didn't think it was police. I thought he was going to kill me. First thoughts when he was being chased. Later learning the pursuers were police officers, members of the now defunct Gun Trace Task Force. Demetric Simon does not want his face shown because of concerns about police corruption. I fear for my safety. I don't think that I could ever rely on the police to assist me in any type of way, not in Baltimore. He agreed to talk to 11 News following the conviction of former detective Robert Hankard. Somewhat, somewhat a relief. Feel bad about it. A jury found Hankard guilty Monday of multiple crimes, including planting drugs and providing a BB gun that he knew would be planted on a suspect. Simon was the suspect. All the officers responsible, both in outright corruption and casual corruption, um, I think need to be held to task. With his attorneys, Simon filed a $17 million lawsuit in March against Baltimore City, Hankard, and others involved, including former Detective Wayne Jenkins, who led the Gun Trace Task Force. Simon's attorneys said the officers had no probable cause and violated his civil rights when they pursued him. They say Jenkins hit and pinned Simon with an unmarked vehicle. So when the car catapulted, it landed on top of him and the wheel was spinning above him. The attorneys are relying on information from the GTTF Independent Investigation Report released in January and a federal court transcript from a meeting with a federal judge concerning police corruption in Baltimore City and the consent decree calling for improvements. The lead investigator told the court Jenkins literally drives his car into a suspect, rams his car into the individual. They come to rest with the front wheel spinning over the suspect's head and there is no evidence Demetric Simon had a gun or had drugs or anything else. Insult upon injury. They go and plan a gun. He spends 10 and a half months, wasn't convicted, just eventually somehow it got quietly null pros. Spent three weeks in jail even after the null pros. That case against Simon dropped as he now tries to show officers violated his rights. It's like I don't, I don't trust the police. I'm leaving with no trust in the police at all, not Baltimore police.